Hey everybody, it's Jack and Dan. And today we're making a plant-based Parma pasta bake. All right, so we're making some pasta, and the reason that we're calling it a plant-based Parma pasta bake is because we got this fancy new little Barilla uh, pasta sauce here made in Parma. That's Parma, Italy. The real Parma, not Parma, Ohio, where me and Drew Carey are from, right? Yeah. But My Parma, grandma lives there, too. That's right. That's where Grandma Grammary live. Yeah. Parma's an awesome place. We thought it'd be cool to try. They got this new sauce, and they made the serving size a half of a cup, which is always a great thing to look for. If you start seeing a little quarter of a cup or little serving sizes, chances are they're just trying to hide how much sodium and stuff is in it. So this is actually pretty healthy. Got that at Mark's for about two bucks a jar. Also... Um, so that's, uh, that's gluten-free and doesn't have any dairy or anything, so that's good for Mickey and good for us. And then, of course, we're using the Bonza. Now, Bonza was developed because it was for people that had gluten intolerances. They use a flour made from chickpeas instead of, let me focus on that, there we go. They use a, uh, flour made from chickpeas. Well, the nice part about that is, is not only does it not have any gluten, it's full of protein and it's full of fiber so uh, usually we look for to try to have a you know decent amount of fiber so full of fiber full of protein and it cooks up just like regular pasta you can get that for about two bucks a box these days so you're gonna get more protein more fiber than regular pasta and then what we did is we got some beyond beef again great great stuff they're selling that at marks too about eight bucks but a lot of times we actually get it for seven or six because it's close to expiring hummus is my favorite which is exactly what happened today hummus is jack's favorite yeah. which is exactly what happened today because today this expired so they had little peel off coupons on them for a buck off so we actually got it for seven bucks instead of 7.99 and we're chopping this up now why are we using the beyond beef instead of using like gardein because gardein contains soy and that does not be on beef dinner. Right, and Mickey beyond can't beef. have soy. Yeah. So we're eating plant-based. We're not getting any soy. We're using the pea protein, Beyond Beef. So we got lots of protein. So what we're doing is we're going to chop this up. We're going to cook it up. We're going to add a sauce to it. We're going to add the noodles and the sauce together. We're going to put them in. Oops, I got the lids over here. We're going to put them in a big pan here. Lay them all out. And then we're going to put some, of course, of our wonderful favorite. Where's it at? There it is. The Follow Your Heart Parmesan shredded cheese. We're going to put that on top, which is basically made from coconut oil, has a little bit of saturated fat, but no cholesterol. No cholesterol. So, no dairy, no soy, no gluten. All right, so I want to show you guys something. It's kind of a little thing that a lot of people don't realize. A lot of these plant based meats, they are healthier for sure, and they are, you know, no cholesterol and and, and all that and they come down in price and they're a lot healthier but a lot of them still have a lot of coconut oil in them which adds a lot of saturated fat well just like with meat you can actually drain this and so this has been cooking on here and as this coconut oil starts to break down you can see it'll actually come out of here so this is oil there's not a ton in here but again it's something that most people don't realize that you can do and so not a lot came out of there but you know, a couple tablespoons. And you got to remember, a tablespoon of coconut oil has 12 grams of saturated fat in it. That's a lot. They and absolutely hot, run hot water down your drain when you're d dumping grease, obviously, too. But anyway, the whole point of them doing that is they're trying to make these plant-based meats a little more appealing. These are like crossover types of foods for um, people that are trying to get healthier and get used to not eating so many animal products and so much cholesterol and saturated fat. Because heart disease is the leading cause of death in the entire world. So if you want to cut that down, use things like this. But again, since we're adding sauce to it, we don't need it to be really moist and greasy. We can drain some of that off and get rid of some of that saturated fat. And this sauce is called uh, Vero Gusta. Yeah, this is a Barilla derivative. So we're going to take this right here now that we've chopped all this up. And we're just going to add the sauce. Okay, guys, look at that. We've got this awesome sauce from Parma, Italy. We have the Bonza noodles. Look at how meaty that looks. We're going to take some of this. We're just going to put it all over the top. Mm -hmm. I, don't, I don't know that I'm going to use the whole thing. I'm going to say a little half. bit. <laughs> Jack really likes this Parmesan. Um, 
we'll probably be trying to make a lasagna sometime soon mm -hmm. too that'll be really good and we yeah. can use either a gluten-free or a bonza bonza does make lasagna noodles as well so yeah i probably am gonna pretty much use the whole thing because this is pretty deep and you guys love this so so here we go we're gonna pop this in the oven for a minute so this is really awesome uh we kind of brown the top a little bit and let the cheese melt a little bit this is gonna be fantastic so mickey has tutoring tonight he's gonna be online for a while uh we're gonna show him see show his reaction in a minute he's never had this before but we're gonna go ahead and eat and then when he gets done with his tutoring he's gonna come ahead and eat so how, what do you think of this buddy how did it come out oh pretty good i'm about to taste it mm. Lots of flavor. Awesome sauce. Definitely. And the pasta's good. The sauce is good. The Beyond Beef's good. I love the meat. Yeah. You said it was very beefy, huh? Yeah. So again, this is just a this is just an alternative to still eat healthy, even if you have a lot of allergies or allergens or you're trying to cut things out. And you can still have some of the foods that you're traditionally used to having. Mickey's gonna love this probably. So we'll show you in a minute how he likes it. And of course Lacey cannot wait to get hers <laughs> she's watching jack as we took it out this came out awesome guys yep. i mean it came out awesome so we're gonna all have some we'll show you re uh, mickey's reaction in a minute how good was that man it was cheesy and saucy and really good <laughs> undescribable next time we're adding mushrooms too yeah yeah so incredibly awesome i think mickey's gonna love it lace just hang on <laughs> all right so there's mickey killing the last bit of it how was it man pretty good yeah Pretty awesome. Yeah, pretty awesome. Tastes just like it would be normal. Can't yeah, even tell there's like all that normal. different stuff. Nothing different. Nothing different. Yeah. Awesome. Lacey's waiting for. <laughs> all right, man. We'll see you next time. Say bye, Lace.